Heartland Coalition's East County Magazine has completed three successful projects with Community Enhancement Grant funds, reaching hundreds of thousands of residents and visitors through our internet and audio projects. Now, with your help, we'll take that to the next level and add videos in a new series entitled East County Adventures, Activities, and Attractions. We'll take you on the road through our scenic mountains, desert, and rural areas to discover our inland region's hidden treasures. Anza Borrego Desert State Park is the largest state park in California, a jewel in the state park system. From hiking the rugged Borrego Badlands to stargazing, exploring mud caves, in viewing the beautiful wildflowers in springtime. This is the destination you'll never forget. Along the drive to Borrego Springs, you'll pass through a boulder-strewn landscape that looks like a lost world. Keep a sharp eye out for bighorn sheep, for which Borrego is named. You can also see art shows, or visit a sculpture garden, and even enjoy up-close encounters with dinosaurs. <laughs> The desert is rich in history, including prospectors, pioneers, Spanish explorers, Civil War soldiers, and more. The historic Gold Rush Town of Julian is another of East County's gems. You'll hear tales from Julian's colorful past as we take you on a horse-drawn carriage ride. Try your hand at gold panning and apple picking. We'll show you how Julian's famous apple pies are made and try out some apple cider. Plus, we'll take you to a famous fiddle competition and into Eagle Peak Gold Mine to experience life as a gold miner. Julian is a destination for all seasons, and in winter, Julian and nearby Mount Laguna transform into winter wonderlands. You can even go sledding. When visiting our mountain areas, you can camp in one of our beautiful San Diego County parks, such as Heise Park near Julian, which also has cozy cabins, or stay at a historic hotel or a bed and breakfast inn. Rancho Cuyamaca State Park is one of my favorite places year-round. Lake Cuyamaca is a great place to go fishing, or you can rent a rowboat. Cuyamaca has campgrounds, 
and in late spring and early summer, Green Valley Falls is just a short hike to view the falls and wade in the waters at its base. If you're up for a more challenging adventure and a full day of hiking, Cleveland National Forest has the amazing Cedar Creek Falls and Three Sisters Falls, plus the Pacific Coast Trail. Welcome to Ramona. Besides its Wild West heritage, which you can discover at the Guy B. Woodward Museum, Ramona is also a nationally recognized wine growing region. You can taste wines at local wineries or even do some grape stopping. We'll also take you along historic Highway 94 through rolling green hills in Hamoodle to the Sweetwater National Wildlife Refuge and the wineries of Highway 94. Pacific Southwest Railway Museum in Campo celebrates its centennial in 2019. Let's take a ride. They call this the Impossible Railway because it was almost impossible to build. Campo's old stone store is now a county museum. Back in the Wild West days, the famous Campo gunfight took place right here. San Diego's inland region is home to 19 Native American tribes, more than any other county in America. We'll visit a powwow where Indians from across the U.S. compete. Our local tribes also own resort hotels, casinos, an outlet shopping center, and championship golf courses. There are many great festivals and street fairs, as well as a variety of amazing parades in our historic towns across East County. I'm looking forward to checking out Pine Valley Days, Descanso Days, Alpine's Parade of Lights and Snow Festival, Julian's Gold Rush Days, Apple Festival and Fourth of July Parade, Lakeside's Western Days and Rodeos, to name just a few. East County has many beautiful lakes for fishing, hiking, and nature walks, kayaking, canoeing, and water skiing. You can camp out or even stay in a teepee. The county also operates many amazing parks and will take you to some of our favorites. And after a fun day around San Diego County, there are great casinos which have something for everyone. East County has a rich agricultural heritage. Come with us to visit a camel dairy, where you can watch a camel show, feed and ride a camel, We'll also take you to a lavender farm in Valley Center, Summers Pass Farms in Flynn Springs, and a pumpkin patch in Lakeside, complete with a hayride. Come along with us on adventures including horseback riding, rock climbing, flights on vintage planes, and more. Plus, we have some more exotic destinations to visit, including lions, tigers, and bears, an amazing rescue facility in Alpine, 
and the San Diego Zoo Safari Park in San Pasqual Valley. On behalf of the Heartland Coalition and East County Magazine, our team thanks county supervisors for their generosity in funding our past projects. Our destination East County radio show and column previewing events across our region and our Backcountry Hidden Pleasures series on weekend getaways at unique lodging in East County and nearby attractions. Hundreds of thousands of people have visited our site or tuned in to learn about East County through those projects. But there's a lot more to discover, and video is the most exciting way to show off all that East County has to offer local residents and tourists from around the world. Bringing visitors to East County also helps boost our local economy in towns across our inland region.